Hi, welcome or welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time seeing my hands, hi, I'm Erin of Playing Life with Erin, and I'm so excited you decided to check out this video. Thank you so much for being here, and if you're returning, hey, hey, how have you been? All right, guys, it is Monday, April 15th. It is the very first day of April, April vacation, and um, I'm a little late than normal because I forget every vacation. There are little people in the house and I have to tend to them and do different things. And just when I think I'm going to sit down and plan, they have different ideas. So finally sitting down, I think it's like almost 11 o'clock. I'm going to actually try to film a few videos today. Um, I have three planner spreads that I need to get set up for myself for the week. And um, then this way I have some free time and I know what's going on <laughs> and I'm not feeling lost, dazed and confused and all the things. Um, and then this way we can have some time this week to do all the things. Okay, so I think for today we're using like a bunch of different kits. I'm going to kind of like piece together something. Um, I was going to do just kind of like a black and white type like planner palette like cleanse kind of spread but then um when I was looking through my kits and things um I still have tulip fields I have a lot left in tulip fields and then I still have like all the pieces to um the March monthly kit which seems to match pretty good and if you've been here you know these are my favorite colors right now um and then of course I have my trackers here and a spring break sticker so now my washi. I'm trying to decide on my washi. I kind of, I was, I pulled out this one because I was thinking like, oh yeah, we'll just do like something like clean and neat this week, but with like no, not no color, but limited color. But now I'm not sure. Um, because then I found this kit and I'm like, mm, I have to do this table break, but I think I'm going to use this, um, this washi. This came with one of the the subs, I think, last year. I forget which one, mm, which I can remember, but it was my favorite, and I used all the stickers. Like, as soon as it came in, I used them all. I'm like, oh, whoops. But we're going to start with this one. I do want to trim this top part, though, because I like to start with a straight line. So we're going to do this. And also, it's spring break, so we kind of go through all the emotions, so I thought this was kind of fitting. All right, I will bring you guys down a little bit, and we're going to put this right on the top. So, so far today, actually, you know what? I'm going to take my shirt off. Well, not my shirt. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. It's not that kind of video. Um, my flannel, because I am kind of warm. I was cold, now I'm warm. Um, I turned the heat on a little bit, even though it is a, a beautiful day here in Rhode Island. Um, it still stays cold in my house. Like, it could be nice and warm outside, but my house is freezing. And I kind of go outside to warm up. So, it's that kind of a morning. I'm not going to complain. We had rain yesterday. It started off really sunny and pretty and promising, and then it got cloudy and rainy. Um, but today and tomorrow, or tomorrow, I think it's supposed to be warmer than today. I'm not sure. I slept through the news this morning. Um, but I think it's gonna be warmer tomorrow. We have plans tomorrow. We're excited. We finally get to hang out with my cousin and my nieces. I'm really excited about that. I have missed them. So that will be nice. I think, so I did my, I like having this below part, but I do like this too. I don't know. All right, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it at the bottom. I do like it. It's nice if I get it on there straight. So, so far today, I've been woken up three times, or I was woken up, I should say, three times by all three of my family members. First time was Joe, as he was getting ready this morning at like 5.15. He's like, what time do you want to sleep till? Like, till I feel like getting up. <laughs> but that, that was enough to wake me up. I'm a fairly light sleeper. Um, I don't have trouble falling asleep. I have trouble staying asleep. So once that woke me up, I was like, well, I'm going to get up. And then... Um, I was on the couch and I decided to kind of curl up and just close my eyes for a little while. So I did that and then Weston came out and he was he gave me a kiss on the cheek and he wanted to know if I was feeling okay because normally when I go to sleep like that, I have a migraine. So I was telling him that I was fine and all of that. 
Well, that was the second time I was woken up. And then I managed to kind of doze off again. And then, kind of like that. Oh, wait a minute. You know what? Oh, wait a minute. Can I take this off? Let's see if I can get this off. I just took it down, so I probably will be able to. Mm -hmm. Careful. Yes. Okay. Minimal, minimal damage. But I'm thinking, instead of having two emojis next to each other, we'll do this. Oh, and we'll do it up like that. Cute. Okay, I like that. And then we'll put this one down on this corner. Here comes Spencer. Okay, we had to get our second snack of the morning. I just love having my kids home, guys. <laughs> I just said to Spencer, I'm like, no, no, it's fine. Um, it ends up taking me a lot longer to film because I'm always having to stop, which is all right. It's fine. I just, I forget... I get over ambitious when I have like my idea of what I'm doing and then what actually happens. Okay, what do you use? What colors did I use? Let's see. Let's go back to that spread. I used this one and then I used green. And then what did I use? I don't think I used any actually for my March. Ah, I'm losing things. For my March layout. No. Okay. So, wait, what color is that one? Hmm. Where's my swatch book? I'm a little unorganized also. Having the kids home, I really enjoy having the kids home. Um, but I'm a little all over the place and definitely off of my, my routine. <clears throat> All right, let's see. What color was that? April, here she comes again. I feel like that was a tan color. Let's look. I think this one might be too bright. Maybe. Might have been 992. All right, you know what? We're not gonna use this one. We're gonna go with a neutral. So we'll do that and then we'll do, hmm. What's another good neutral that I have? Could do a lighter one. All right, we're gonna just work with neutral colors today, I think, because I don't have like the exact green. I do have a pink, but it's too dark. All right, we're just gonna work with the neutrals today. I don't have that much brain power today. <laughs> okay, so we'll start off with my sidebar. Yeah, so I've already been woken up like twice, three times this morning, the third time is Spencer. <laughs> she, she was calling my name and she didn't realize that um, I was sleeping and then she wasn't sure um, what was going on. So she was like kind of looking for me and all that stuff. And this pen is not working again. Okay, so that's fine. We won't use that one. We'll use this one. <laughs> I was gonna use, so I got it to work the other day. I think I did, I think I got it to work when I did my planner check-in, if I remember correctly. Um, and it was working fine. I was just using it. So I don't know. I did use the converter and there isn't a whole lot of ink that, it, that goes into that. So maybe I ran out. That's okay. Get my habits down and we'll put my sleep tracker out. All right. So this week is a fairly, what color do we want to use? Let's use green. Um, a fairly easy going week already. Oh wait, no, I can't put that on yet. I have to write in my actual habits first. That's helpful, right? So this week is going to be a fairly, um, kind of boring week, I guess. We have plans tomorrow. Well, maybe not too boring. We have plans tomorrow. Thursday is like going to be our like my market day. And then Friday we have to take Spencer for her MRI. So I guess it's not super boring. Hopefully get in some walking today and tomorrow since it's going to be really nice out. Eat well. And then my visualization. 
foundations. Okay, there's nothing more terrifying than your kid scares you. I just happened to look up and West was standing like right in front of me. <laughs> and I wasn't expecting that. He was all stealth coming out here. So that was me getting jump scared by my child. All good in the hood. He had to go to the bathroom. He just wanted to make sure I didn't have to go, which I appreciate. But don't scare me, child. <laughs> it's weird because I kind of get into a zone when I'm working and I'm doing my like, planning. And usually... You know, I hear doors open, I hear like walking down the hallway, but he was just very stealth. Did not hear that. Okay, this is going to be my habits. Where is my, there we go. We'll get my little tiny icons, or not my habits, my cozy hobbies. And today we are going to spell the words correctly. <laughs> okay. That out. And I'm probably going to have to order some more sheets of these. I actually ordered some stickers yesterday because, um, and I'm going to do, I think, so if you're interested in subscribing to the channel, go ahead and do that now so you don't forget. Um, and if you want to be notified, hit that little bell notification that'll notify you anytime we come up with something new here on the channel. But I'm thinking about filming a planner update, like a planner, um, oh my goodness, I can't do two things at once, just a planner update. So I've kind of updated, um, some things have stayed the same and then a couple of things changed, like nothing crazy, crazy, but, um, just like a planner, um, I keep wanting to say planner haul. It's not a planner haul video, just a planner update, like what my planner stack actually looks like now, what worked um, and what hasn't worked. I think that like we're in April now. So I think that's a good time to kind of reevaluate. And then this way we could introduce some new things coming to the channel and the reason and the why and what I'm going to use it for. So I'll be on the lookout for that, but that I was planning on doing that video this week along with um, washi tape and sticker storage video and my regular, our regular um, plan with me is, however, like I said in the beginning of this video, sometimes I get a little over ambitious when it's school vacation. Technically, I guess I should just start for, like really early in the morning. <laughs> Not necessarily before they wake up because they are early birds, um, but I feel like, oh, I didn't do that again. Maybe, do I want to do it down here? All right, maybe we'll do it this way. We'll do Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. That works. I like that. Not terrible. Um, but yeah, I think I have to like do it early. I forget like, you know, there's a lot that goes into the kids being home and then like they wake up in shifts. So, like Weston's up really early and then Spencer gets up about an hour after him and then he already wants his breakfast. So there's like a lot of different things. And then I go to sit down and, and try to do what I want to do and I get lost in journaling and then I'm like, oh my God, my time is there. I gotta get ready and all the things. Um, I love having time off to just breathe, but at the same time, I'm terrible without a schedule. Okay, so I do want to add in, before I forget... I really like this quote. It says, it's not just a notebook. It's your bulletproof plan for conquering the day, armed with bullets of tasks, arrows of direction, and of course, the occasional shield of humor. Um, I'm just trying to figure out where I want to put it. This is from the washi tape shop. It's like a whole roll of quotes. And I was thinking about adding in some quotes since I don't have, these are the only two graphics that I have but from my kit. So I was thinking about adding in some of these. So let's see. I do like that there. I kind of like it in the middle also, but I don't want to cut it. So let's see. Tomorrow we're going to be out. So maybe. Hmm. I think I'm going to stick with my original thought and I'm going to put it here. Okay. Let's get this down. Oh, that's my heat. I told you guys I turned it up a little bit. Maybe I shouldn't have. Ooh, cute. Okay. I just like that. I thought it was so cute. There's a few um, different cute quotes 
It's not just a notebook, it's your visual memoir of daily victories. Each bullet, doodle, and a checklist is a page in the epic tale of you conquering life one day at a time. I really, I really like some of these quotes in here. Um, so we might add another one, we'll see. Okay, so we've got that down, and then I want to do my happy moments. So we'll get these two post-its, and let's see what we have here. Oh, I do have a happy moment. This is um, the week's March monthly kit, and I decided to use it, um, I think in my weeks, last week. I think it was last week. I don't remember now, but I... No, maybe it wasn't. Maybe it was the week before. Anyways, um, I really love this. I, I think I ordered another one. Put it in an order. And I'm pretty certain I ordered this. And like I was saying, so, okay, I got a little off topic there. I am going to be doing a planner lineup update. There we go. I found the words finally. See? Maybe some more coffee will be helpful. Oh, speaking of coffee, look at this mug, guys. Oh, my gosh. I don't know if you can see it. I got it at Home Goods yesterday. I was like, oh, I need that in my life. Okay. Um, yeah, so we're going to do a, a planner stack update because I do have a couple planners that I've added in, a couple like um, just changes that I'm making that I feel like um, will help in the long run because, you know, in December, well, anywhere from October to December when I'm figuring out what I want my planner lineup to look like. Um, I see a lot of different things and I want to like, you know, do all the things and have all the things and all that. Um, and then I try to kind of like work backwards and say, well, this is going to work for me. Um, and all that good stuff. But, um, then as I start planning in them, I start to realize like, Ooh, maybe not so much. So I've definitely added... Um, a couple of things and, I, and I've altered a couple of things. So stay tuned for that. I'm pretty excited um, on what I've decided on. So stick around for that. Um, what do I want to do? Weston has karate. I'm still trying to work out the logistics of Friday. So Weston has karate on Thursday. And he's going to actually stay at my mom's house Thursday night. So we have to be at the hospital early. So just so I don't have to worry about, you know, the hold on one more minute kind of <laughs> conversations that we have sometimes, I don't want to get nervous. So we're going to, he's going to have a sleepover at grandma's house, but, and I was thinking since we run errands on Thursday, that would be a great day for him to just stay there after we're done. Like I can leave him with my mom, but then I started thinking about it. I'm like, oh wait, he has karate. So that's not going to work. So I think that we'll just take him there after karate. And then maybe we'll get dinner first and then I'll drop him off. That probably is what's going to happen. Let's see. I feel like... Oh, ah. Like, we don't have too many plans this week with friends, which is hard. It's like summer vacation really is the best time to hang out with people. Because, like, today is a day where I just needed, I made no plans today. I was like, nope. Because um, we had date night on Saturday night. We'll talk about that in a minute. But because we had date night Saturday night, um, I don't know. I just, I didn't have a chance to do what I wanted to do yesterday. And, like, I kind of try to take opportunities I'm a weird human. I try to take opportunities where I can, um, like, have breaks and, like, just, like, throw care to the wind and not have to worry about doing any of the things. And then what ends up happening is, um, I'm like, oh, I'll just do it tomorrow. And then tomorrow comes and I'm like, oh, <laughs> should have done it yesterday. So... I took today as an opportunity to um, finish folding the laundry. Like I have some of Joe and I's laundry that needs to be folded and I have to prep out lunches and things like that. So yeah, but our date night was nice guys. I put a picture up in the community post. So I hope if you had a chance to see that, um, we went to this place called the Jefferson Speakeasy. 
and I went with my girlfriends actually during February break and I was really excited to take Joe because I, I had a really strong feeling he would like it and he did <laughs> so that was really cool um I'm trying to think hold on what else do I have going on this week I think that's it um so it was really cool it was fun like being in there and like you know um we had a couple of appetizers though I was a little disappointed because we wanted um empanadas and they ran out so we ended up getting like a um They were like tater tots, basically. And they were, um, they had like nacho cheese on them or whatever. It was good, but it had like a very like food truck vibe to it. Um, so I don't know. It probably wouldn't be our first choice next time, but it was still good. But we had a couple of drinks um, and the atmosphere is just really, really great. All right. So habits is spelled with one B, just in case anybody needed to know. Let's see if I can actually remember it this time. habits. I did it. <laughs> um, so the atmosphere is really nice in there. It's very, it's kind of like swanky. I don't know how else to describe it. Um, it's not like it's dressy or anything like that, but, um, it's just, I don't know. It's like kind of dark and dim and it's like not necessarily romantic, but it's a speakeasy. So it kind of, it gives like the speakeasy vibes. Um, definitely like it in there. Although I was kind of sad because my drink, um, I wasn't sure what I wanted. I'm not a huge drinker. It's like my, neither is Joe, but he does like his scotch and whiskey and stuff like that. Where me, I'm like, ew, this stuff smells so bad. But <laughs> we went and I decided to get, um, like, a kind of like a pineapple and coconut rum type drink. Like I was just kind of asking if they had coconut rum and if it was fruity. And then he told me that, um, the waiter told me that they have like, they don't have like, um, like, hold on, let me write this before I mess up. There we go. They don't have like the flavored syrups and whatnot, which wasn't really what I was asking for anyways, but, um, it gave it to me in a Cobra glass. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. I was like hoping for like a really cute, um, just drink glass, I guess. But I got it in a Cobra glass. I'm like, oh, all right, I guess this will do. And I was kind of jealous. Joe had the cool glasses. But anyways, um, it was a very nice night. We definitely needed that, um, date night, so... I was excited. And because we are old, <laughs> no, we went, we actually went around, I think seven, which was late for us for dinner. Um, like to go out for dinner, um, since like the pandemic had started or whatever, we kind of got in this habit of like going out like closer to five kind of thing, kind of like beat the crowd, but still enjoy being out. Um, so we went, we can't, we took the kids, um, let's see, 8 a.m. And then I do want to move something. So we took the kids to my parents' house around, I actually want to just put this here like that. So it's like all the information I need and then I can still use that. Um, yes, I took the kids to my mom's house, um, probably like around 4.30 and then we came home, we decided to take a shower and actually get ready. So that was nice. It actually felt like a date night. Like I should have kicked them out and told them to come back and pick me up, but <laughs> that's okay. Um, so yeah, so it was a lot of fun. I enjoyed it. Um, we ended up coming home like around 9, 9.30, which is so funny because part of me is like, Oh, wow, look at us staying out late. And then, like, we we're kind of thinking about going somewhere else to have another drink, but budget, you know. <laughs> so we ended up coming home, and we did one of our favorite things. We turned the music up, and we danced around the kitchen because we're funny like that. Uh, I hope we always dance. But we were dancing and just having a grand old time, and then we decided to play some cards. Um, but, yeah, it was really... It was a really nice date night. I, I enjoyed myself thoroughly. 
All right, let's see. Oh, I do have a heart. I'll put this here for Auntie Jess's house because we're excited to go. We'll put this here. So this way, if we want to write a little something, I'm excited to see my nieces and give my cousin her birthday gift because her birthday was March 2nd. <laughs> so it was, it was a while ago. Um, Saturday and Sunday. Why do I feel like... I always feel like I've got something going on and then there isn't anything. So we had date night was here. MRI Saturday. Hmm. I guess I don't have anything. Okay. Looking pretty good, guys. Let's get some pen to paper. My morning this morning was different than normal. But we will put in, let's see. Breakfast. I got ready. did my morning reset. Um, and then what did I do? Oh, I printed out Weston's um, report card. Which he did really good on. It was like straight A's. It's like, gosh. <laughs> I sent a picture of it to Joe. Joe was like, oh my gosh. He's like, you got an A even in gym? I'm like, yeah, apparently. <laughs> He's like, I never got an A in gym. I'm like, I never got an A in gym. <laughs> it's like the easiest class. And I never, I had like this thing where I just didn't want to change for gym. So, um, I wouldn't get credit for gym, but I did have a really cool gym teacher that had like the cool classes. Like he did like gymnastics or trampoline or walk the track and he didn't care if you didn't have your gym clothes on um he would say something but um he didn't give you like no grade like you know what I mean like he didn't say absent from class or no credit or whatever he would do um he would give you give you a grade and he was a really cool guy he actually just passed away um so it's sad I remember him he was pretty cool Okay, um, but yeah, so we did really good. So tomorrow morning, let's see. I want to try to leave between 9 and 10. That's usually a good time because then we actually have to get home because Weston has karate. So tomorrow morning, what can I get done before we go? My morning reset. And I'm actually going to put in here a 10-minute workout because... I need to um, get better with that. I need to actually start working out and stop saying I'm going to work out because I don't know. I keep like, Joe and I have like these great long conversations at night where we're like, we're going to do this and we're going to do that and we're going to do this. And then like, and then we don't <clears throat> or it alters or whatever. Something comes up. I'm sick. I have a migraine, whatever. Speaking of, I feel like I might be getting sick. I'm really hoping I'm not. And that's the other thing. Like, that's another reason why I want to kind of plan out what I need to do this week and see what I can do. It might be like heavily loaded in the next two days, but that's all right. Um, then I'll just free me up for the rest of the week. But, um, I don't know. I think it, it might be allergies. They're saying like the allergens right now are pretty bad. Like even people that don't normally have allergies are having allergies. Just just texting me. We're still talking about the report card. I think I want to put this here. Like this, these are my afternoon tasks. I have to go to Stop and Shop because I forgot a couple of things. So let's write in Stop and Shop. I need all the lactate things. So I need lactate, milk. Ice cream, sour cream, um, cottage cheese. I went to go prep out breakfast yesterday and I couldn't do it because I didn't have cottage cheese. Um, and then goldfish, Spencer requested goldfish. And then we have some laundry to get done. Just folding, no big deal. <clears throat> Hear that in my voice? I know I sound like that a lot sometimes, but. I'm very scratchy right now, so I'm almost positive that I've got some um, allergy thing going on. Um, 
but fingers crossed it's nothing more than that because we are going to my cousin's house tomorrow. The last time during February vacation, we didn't, we weren't able to go because they had strep. But we're going tomorrow. All right, I'm trying to see what else. Um, I don't have room to put in my cozy hobbies for today, but I plan on taking some time for myself at some point today. I want to play some of my game and I have a new obsession. I have been doing like a color by number on my iPad and it's super duper addicting, just saying. All right, let's see. Let's put in what we're doing today. So we're going to, I already answered some emails. Answer emails and then film. Trying to make sure that nobody's sneaking down the hallway. Does, does it frighten me again? I hear movement. Okay, so so far, that is what I was on my agenda for today, and then I have to do some edits. Okay, so it's looking pretty good. A weekend is pretty blah. I have nothing going on this weekend apparently. I do want to see, I don't think I do, but I wanted to see if I have any more weekend banners. But I don't think I do. I think I used them all and I was supposed to order more and I forgot. But let's check one other spot. And let's see what I've got, if I have anything. Oh, I have to pick up medicine. The, my little syringe just <laughs> reminded me. Okay, I don't think I have any more weekend banners. No, I do not. Okay, so we will we'll write it in. Why not, right? Get my brush pen and just write in. Hopefully I'm not writing it too big because I have a tendency of doing that. All right. It's not my best, but we'll write it in again. My E's are a little weird. Okay, that looks good. That's not terrible. Did you guys see any of that? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. If I was out of frame, I apologize. Okay, there's my weekend. We am will probably do something. I'm not gonna put it in yet. When I do my planner check-in, we will do this part of my week. Um, I kind of already know what I do in the mornings for the most part, like tomorrow. This is the plan for tomorrow. Um, and then I do wanna write in here. Do I have, hmm, I don't know if I have one. Like a sleeping emoji? Hmm, let's see. Let's look. I know I have like a sleep in and go to bed early kind of thing, but I'm not sure if I have just like a sleeping emoji. Let's look here. That one's kind of sleepy. Oh, this is where it came from. It was the July kit. That's where, or the July sub. That's where this came from. All right. Um... I don't have like, just like laying in bed. This one's a little lamb sleeping. I'm gonna use that one. That one's working in bed, reading in bed, eating in bed. <laughs> Let's see. I think I might go with, that one's sad. He's not sad when he sleeps over my mom's house, so we can't go with that one. Let's do this little lamb sleeping. I don't think there's any other ones. Yeah, we'll just do the little sleeping lamb. That works. Since I already came out here and asked if we could get boba tea. I'm like, oh, not today. All right, we'll put this guy here. Oops, I got caught. And then we'll put Weston sleeping at mom's. 
but that works. I like how this looks so far. I have no idea. I would be completely honest. I have no idea what I'm doing for dinner. The only night I know is what's for dinner is Friday. It's pizza night. <clears throat> Wednesday is Casey Diaz. Wait, I wrote it down over here. I will remember how to spell this. And then I have no idea what to do for the rest of these nights. I think Thursday we might. Well, by the time it gets out, six, seven. I guess we could. We will have Thursday be a dining out tonight. Okay. Oh, I know what I need to do. I need to make a phone call today. I'm going to put it in here, but I'm going to highlight it. You know, it's kind of like, this is just like a task thing, I guess. That's what it's panning out to be. I was going to kind of time block, but that's not working. So let's do, I have to call uh, Ortho Doctor. All right. This is looking pretty darn good. Do I want to add anything else? I still have some, I, like these kits last forever. Um, that is the third page, right? I have all three pages. Let's see. Is there anything else I want to add in here? Let's do this little bubble, like a think bubble for my morning on Wednesday, because why not? Okay. And Spencer can't, oh, wait a minute. She can't eat after a certain time. No solids after 8 a.m. Wait a minute, 8 a.m. appointment. Oh, 3 a.m. Hi. I know I can read my own handwriting. Okay, so we should still be fine. She can't have anything to eat after 3 a.m. She can have water popsicles or juice in the morning. Okay, and I do need to ask about brushing teeth or any liquid medication. I think it should be fine, but I want to double check. Um, all right. What else? I think that's it. I have budgeting that I want to take care of on Wednesday and my market order. So let me, let's do, let's do this guy for my market orders. Oops. And then that's my budgeting. Um, that's why I want to do a new planner lineup because I actually got something different to do my budgeting in. Because I'm trying to get better. Joe and I are trying to get better. Marketing orders? All right, that's fine. So I was thinking budgeting. And then I do need to put a reminder in on Sunday. So let's do... This one, I have to remember to Venmo my sister-in-law money for our Pocono strip. All right. Okay, because so it's next week. I think I might be able to call this done for now. And then when we do our planner check-in, it will definitely fill in more. I'm just not sure about what I'll have to do tomorrow. Like when we come back from my cousin's house, Weston will have karate. Spencer does not have dance as far as I know. She typically doesn't have dance. They follow um, like the schedule of uh, the school. So I don't think she has dance tomorrow night. <clears throat> Weston will still have karate both nights. So that's fine. Do we want to... Put in anything. I'm supposed to be getting an order today, but I don't think it's coming because I haven't seen that it hit my post office, which means it'll be here tomorrow. But we'll put that in when I do my planner checkup. And do I want to use any more of these quotes? Let's look at that and then these are just the ones that I cut off. You'll grow beautifully in your own way. Ooh, I kind of like that one. Carpe diem, wabi sabi, I don't know what that means. Beautiful imperfection, feel more, think less, don't quit, I am fearless. Uh, let's do find comfort in chaos, I like that one. Grab my scissors I got laying around over here. 
because that's what it kind of feels like. Um, my kids are not chaotic, as you guys can hear. Like, they're both here. They're older kids. Like, they're quiet. Um, my chaos comes from my own brain. <laughs> because I have a chaotic schedule, I guess. Find comfort in chaos. Where do I want to put it? It's a quote right there. I kind of like it here. Let's just put it um. I like it there. I'll put that there. And let's see if I have, I don't have like a, a funny face in white. Let's see. I think I have one. Hold on. I have like the whole, here we go. I knew I had them somewhere. I kept them in here so they were close by. Let me see if I have like the crazy face one. All right, let's see. Probably not. Those were probably the first ones I used. <laughs> oh, I seem to get frustrated. Okay, let's see. Let's do this guy. The winking one. We'll do a crying laughing one because that's how I kind of feel. I'll do the, the sideways one because that one's a little bit more crazy. Okay, that's cute. I like that. I'll put these back so then I know where they are for next time. All right, that was Preston. He came out to apologize because he banged and he thought maybe he disturbed the video when I told him, nope, we were fine. Um, and that I did appreciate the apology. Okay. I think this is going to do it for me for now and then I will come back and I will be able to um, update this on hopefully Friday I'm hoping Friday or Saturday morning usually I've been getting to it on Friday I'm not sure they said it's gonna be about three hours for the MRI I think it's like an hour for the MRI and then we have to get there an hour early and then you know once she wakes up and all that stuff so Hopefully later in the afternoon, Joe's going back to work and then I will have some time and hopefully Spencer will be feeling okay and we can do a planner check-in. If not, Saturday is fine too. Okay, this is looking super cute. I love these colors together. And um, do I wanna add anything else? I think we're good. I was gonna add another quote, but I really don't know where I wanna add it. So I think we're gonna leave it like this for now. Um, and okay. That's going to do it. So as always, guys, thank you so much for taking time out of your day to come and spend it with me. I truly appreciate it. I know we're all busy, so thank you, thank you. Um, if you are interested in subscribing to the channel and you have liked what you've seen and you like things like all Hobonichi and planner things and sticker things and unboxing things and all the things, um, go ahead and hit subscribe and then hit that bell notification for uh, to be notified anytime we come out with something new here on the channel. And if you like this video or any other video we put up on the channel, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. It really helps the channel and we really appreciate it. So thank you very much. All right, guys, until I see you again, have a beautiful week and keep planning. Bye.